Good morning, green lambs. Welcome to circle time. It's a little different than usual. We're going to combine our circle time and our calendar time into one today. So let's start right away with, I'm glad you're here today. I'm glad you're here today. Hello, hello to everyone. I'm glad you're here today. We'll sing and play today. We'll sing and play today. Hello, hello to everyone. We'll sing and play today. How many friends are here today? Here to learn, here to play. How many friends are here today? Let us count them. Friends, you're not here, it's just me. That makes it just one. Unless you're here and then you can count you too. So I'm going to count me one and you two. One, two, only two friends, and we're all at our own homes. It's a little different. Let's start right away with our calendar. I have a little calendar, and these are always a big hit. Everyone likes to see the picture on my calendar. You see I have a little black kitty looking out the window. But if we look over here, my calendar has a big M word right here. March. Did you see that? It says March. Should we stand up and march for March? Are you ready? We'll count to 10. Oh, sorry, I'm running out of space. March, 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 March. This month is March. Great. Now, hmm, what day of the week is it? Let's take a look. We all left school over here on this day, and we had a weekend. So the 12, the 13 was Saturday, the 14 was Sunday, and today is the 15th. So today is March 15th. And if I take my 15 and I go all the way up, this word right here says Monday. Can you say Monday? Good job. So let's put it all together. Repeat after me. Today is Monday, March 22nd, oh, I am sorry, 15th, 2021. So that's March 15th. Don't take Miss Ann's crazy words. March 15th, 2001. And what's the weather like today? What's the weather like today? Look outside, what do you say? Is it chilly? Is it warm? Is it windy? Will it storm? Please, you go and tell me right away. What's the weather like today? Quick, go ahead. I'm going to count to ten so you can come back. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, good job. You should have checked out your window by now. Can you tell me what it's like outside? It's cloudy. It's cloudy at my house. Hmm, I don't know if it's going to rain. What do you think? Do you think it's going to rain? It might. Maybe the sun will come out later. It's going to be kind of cooler than yesterday, too. So you might want to get outside and play today since you won't be able to tomorrow. Because tomorrow it is going to rain. So today we have a cloudy, cool day. Thanks for helping me. Now, we have some new letters this week. Last week we had S, T, and you. And this week we have this new letter. It's the letter V. Big V, little V, 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 V. And V says V. V says V. Every letter makes a sound. V says V. My face looks funny when I do that sound. Does your face look funny? Let's try it together. 
V. This is how you make a V in sign language. It's kind of like you, but you split it apart. V. And you know how we've been doing kitty cat and tiger and jaguar? Well, our V animal is a vulture. And you take your Vs and you swipe them across your eyes. Vulture. Everybody do it with me. Vulture. Very good. V is for vulture. The next letter I have is this letter right here. This is the letter W. Oops, I'm not even showing you. W, big W, little W, wah, wah, wah. W says wah. W says wah. Every letter makes a sound. W says wah. Can you say it with me? Wah. Kind of like wow. Because wow starts with the letter W. To make a W in sign language, instead of a V, with two fingers, we have three fingers. This is W. You can see it right there. Up, down, up, down. Just like this W. W is for whale. So you take your, your W and you make it swim in the ocean. W is for whale. Good job. So we have V for vulture and W for whale. The last letter today is this one and this is a fun one. I like to call this one of the two pirate letters. This one is the letter X. And do you know what X does? X marks the spot. X is where you find the treasure. This is the letter X. If you're looking for treasure on a map, look for the X. X is, X says, oh, I'm sorry, big X. And little X, 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 X. Or sometimes it makes a Z sound, as in xylophone. Sounds like xyla but it's, it starts with an X, not a Z, xylophone. But X is like this in sign language. It's a little hard to make, but the letter or the animal for it is really fun. It's an X-ray fish. X, you hear that X, X, X. So you, you take your arm and you put it out and you take your X and you make an X-ray. And then remember how we talked about snake versus fish. So we have snake, like this, and fish, like this. Fish swims, so we do x-ray fish. You try it with me, x-ray fish. So we have V for vulture, W for whale, and X for x-ray fish. Great job, let's go. Do, 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 all the way back to the letter A. A is for alligator. B is for bear. C is for cat. D is for dog. Remember, you hit your hip and snap, dog. E is for elephant. Show me that trunk. F is for frog, two fingers. G is for giraffe. H is for horse. I is for iguana. J is for jaguar. K is for kangaroo. L is for lion. Draw that mane. M, remember, one, two, three fingers is for monkey <laughs> and two fingers one two is for newt o is for octopus p is for pig q 
point it down, is for quail. R is for rabbit. S is for snake. T is for, remember we make one hand like this? Really, you make a letter A and put it down. Turtle, and he's so cute. U is for your favorite unicorn. V is for vulture. W is for whale. And X is for x-ray fish. I love doing letters with you. It's so fun. Maybe you can show your parents a couple of the new ones today. Remember, we had V for vulture, W for whale, and X for x-ray fish. All right, we're going to learn a new song today. It's called Praise Him, and I'm going to sing it for you, and then we're going to, I'm going to send you a video that you can sing with it, too. It goes, oh, and if you did Easter for Kids or were going to do Easter for Kids this weekend, you got one of these in your bag. If you didn't, that's okay. Go grab a small blanket because we're talking about Jesus' triumphant entry into Jerusalem this week. So the song we're singing is about that triumphant entry. So if you have something to praise Jesus with, if it's your green palm branch or maybe a small blanket, maybe it's even your jacket, that's okay too. I'm going to count to ten. You go grab it. You've got ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, get your praise item out. We're going to go praise him, praise him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Praise him, praise him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Trust him, trust him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. Trust him, trust him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. And then the hardest verse. Love him, love him, all you little children. God is love. God is love, love him, love him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. All right, friends, I will see you later. Go and show God's love today and sing our new praise song. Have a great day. Bye.